All right, so um, we have here a gas burner, a, a kitchen stove burner that will not ignite. All right, so it's not lighting, it's not lighting, it's not light. You can hear that it's sparking, and you can hear that the other the other burners will ignite, don't have any issues. Something's going on with this one right here. And I already know the problem, but I just want to record this for other people. So basically these burners, you've got the gas comes through that orifice down there. It shoots and mixes with air and it comes into this area surrounding and it goes through these holes and then it goes out and then it burns like in the back here. Okay. So the spark comes off of this area right here. So uh, it's not going to spark because I don't have the thing in place. But basically what happens is the spark goes between that metal pin and the little nubby that's sticking up right there. So you get an electric spark from, uh, from there. So you can see the spark right there. So in order for the gas to... Uh, the way that these burners are designed, I don't really like this design, but the way they did it is you can see there's a hole right here. Okay, so some of the gas goes into the hole, which is right in there. You can't really see it. It goes across and it goes into this cavity here and it hits the spark and it ignites and it flashes back into the rest of the burner you know, around the side. What goes on with this type of burner is that hole got some grease in it. So I was frying something or cooking something with a lot of oil. And um, and that hole, as you can see, is plugged up with oil or grease. So we're going to clean that out real quick. Okay, so I've taken some soap and water and a wire and I stuck it in there and cleaned that hole out. So removed all the grease and made sure that there's a pathway for the gas to get from here across so that it can hit the spark and, and ignite. So put this back together and see if it burns. There we go. It's fixed. And that's all there is to it.